Good morning, Nina. Oh, I am so hungry. Good morning, Jai. Breakfast will soon be ready. Good. Is Lin outside playing already? That's right. Since we got the baby goat, she and Anna have been getting up so early. Hmm? Huh? Lin, go get some vegetables from the field. All right. Come on, Bing. Let's go to the field together. I'm coming too. Stay with Bing. Mm. Uh, oh no! Don't eat that! <laughs> Lin! Bing's eating the paper! Don't worry, paper's okay, but I don't think it's very tasty. Come along. Ma. Be a good girl while I'm in school. I'll come back soon. People are starting to use machines in agriculture. But in small <laughs> villages or in the fields in mountainous areas, they still use animals to cultivate fields. Now, what kinds of animals help us in our fields? Uh, Lynn? Yes? Uh, um, baby goats. <laughs> <laughs> Lynn, how did you get the baby goat? My grandparents gave her to me. Her name is Bing. She's really cute. Ooh, can I touch her? What does she eat? Well, come and have a look. I think she ate a plastic bag with food inside, and I guess the plastic bag got stuck in her throat. Hmm, poor baby. waste which looks like food to a baby goat. I'm surprised an animal died from it. There's so much garbage around here lately. That's the cause of this tragedy. happen. We used to wrap things with banana leaves and we could just throw them in the fields. But our lifestyle is changing and there are so many kinds of ways. Nowadays, we use plastic to wrap things. Look at all this. I found lots of rubbish thrown away around the field. Wow, that's a lot. 
We produce too much rubbish and throw it away without thinking. And we shouldn't just throw it everywhere. It's dangerous and it's becoming a big problem in our village. <sighs> Baby goat Bing died. She really loved her. Good morning, boys and girls. I heard that yesterday, Lin's baby goat Bing died. Poor little thing. I heard that Bing ate a discarded plastic bag. I see. Well, we have been seeing a lot more rubbish around this village, so let's talk about waste disposal today, shall we? I've noticed that there's all sorts of rubbish. But humans can't help producing waste. Trash is what we don't need. I throw it away often, too. I was sitting down by the roadside the other day, just watching the clouds drifting by. A car passed, and the driver threw a bag of trash on my head. <laughs> trash should never be thrown away like that. We should be disposed of in the appropriate place. Yeah. I cut my foot on a piece of broken bottle while walking on the grass the other day. Well, that was very dangerous, wasn't it? Now, let's talk about what kinds of things are being thrown away. Yes, teacher. Is Lynn all right now, Mina? She's better now. Thank you for asking. Actually, the baby goat taught us a lot of things. Nora! Uh, do you have any medicine for diarrhea? My child has got a stomach ache. Do you mean Jit? Mm-hmm. How serious is he? It's severe. Here, shouldn't you take him to the clinic right away? Yes, I will do that. Bye. Pit? Here. Yin? Here. Lin? Yes. Pit? Teacher, Jit was taken to the clinic yesterday. Was he? What's the matter with him? Was he injured? Teacher, nope, next to me is absent too. Many students are absent today. The nurse is coming for the monthly health lecture. We shall find out whether there's an epidemic in our area. <coughs> Teacher, it's time for my health lecture. Yes, we've been waiting for you. <coughs> I would like to start my talk now. Oh, yes. Go right ahead. <laughs> Your attention, please. Yesterday, Jit, Nop, and Zia were brought to the clinic. All of them got a stomach ache. <laughs> please be careful of flies, mice, and cockroaches. They carry the pathogenic germs from garbage, which make you sick. Thank you very much for your advice. This is good since we wanted to study more about waste-related problems. Dirty rubbish has plenty of germs which make humans sick. Animals and insects may transmit germs to us. I have a question. Why don't rats, flies, and cockroaches get sick after eating garbage? Well, that's a question I can't answer. <laughs> I asked a fly the other day, and he said there was no problem. <laughs> Just kidding. Well, dirty environment could be one of the reasons why our three friends have got sick. But besides this sort of kitchen garbage, there's loads of trash scattered around us, such as bottles, plastic waste, cans, and so on. Tonight, we will meet to discuss waste management in this village. 
Please ask your fathers and mothers to join us at the meeting. Did you go shopping? Wow, you bought a lot of things. <sighs> yes, I went to the market. Look at these. Plastic bottles and bags and tins. <laughs> I feel as if I've been buying plastic. Yes, and they'll end up as garbage, won't they? Hey, I heard that a meeting will be held about waste disposal tonight. Is that why there are so many dirty bugs flying and crawling around here these days? I hope everyone will be there. We've got to do something. The bugs make such a mess of our neighborhood. We should all put the lids on the trash cans, or maybe just invite the cockroaches and flies to the meeting. <laughs> <laughs> The nurse from the clinic has come here to talk to us about very important health issues, so please listen to her carefully. Yesterday, three children were brought to the clinic. This is most unusual, so I came to the village to find out why. Well, I found out that there is a problem of sanitation in this village, which is caused by lack of waste management. Oh, That's why the baby goat ate a plastic bag and died. Oh. Now, I called the local government official in charge of waste management to talk to us about it. Good evening, everyone. As our lifestyles become more convenience-oriented, so to speak, the amount of waste we create increases. So how do we get rid of it? We can just collect and burn it all. That's not a good way to solve the problem. Burning garbage may produce poisonous gases. Also, if the garbage includes aerosol cans, the cans may explode and cause injury. It's very dangerous. That's true. The last time I burned plastic and rubber garbage, I felt sick to my stomach and vomited. <laughs> That was very dangerous. Burning garbage can produce a poisonous gas called dioxin. Garbage should be sorted into flammable and non-flammable items, and then disposed of properly. And even though we describe it all as waste, some can be recycled. But we must first sort it in order to recycle it. That's true. Sufficiently cleaned plastic and aluminum can be sold to garbage collectors and traders. I've got a lot of those under my house. Good, you can sell them for recycling. Looks like I can make much money this year. You keep everything, even trash. That's why Jit got sick. How <laughs> oh, dare you say that? Calm down, both of you. The good thing about this is... We may be able to earn some money by selling used items. Yeah, right. Shall I ask our children to collect such used items for sale? Then we can buy some things we need for our classes at school. Yeah. I'll collect any organic waste and try to make compost together with the other farmers. That's a good idea. Compost will enrich our fields and we will be able to get more income from that. Each of us can recycle waste. And we would really appreciate everyone's cooperation. Yes, we can use plastic bags over and over again. Oh, I agree. The gift I received the other day was so tiny by the time I removed all the packing. <laughs> Do you mean the one I gave you the other day? Uh -huh. <laughs>